This week, we bring to you a special edition of Stellantis Spotlight, leading into the 8th edition of Motor Trend Presents Roadkill Nights, powered by Dodge. See how the Performance Car Festival grew into an epic event that draws in tens of thousands of muscle car fans each year. What started as a free pop-up event for performance enthusiasts in Michigan and other states across the Midwest has grown in attendance, attractions, and hype. The Dodge-themed event originally offered Viper thrill rides, live music, games, and giveaways, which included awarding a new 6.2-liter supercharged Hemi Hellcat V8 engine to the winner of the first old-school grudge-style drag race. It also included a celebrity grudge match between the crew from the television shows Roadkill and Fast and Loud. Since its inaugural year in 2015, Roadkill Nights has more than quadrupled in size, starting off at just over 10,000 attendees in its first year. What began in the parking lot of the old Pontiac Silverdome then took over the newly opened M1 Concourse in Pontiac, Michigan, and is now at a new location for 2023. As the event expanded year after year, the crowds grew to over 40,000 in 2022, and attractions like the revamped Cruise in Car Show, Dodge Simulator Rides, and the thrill and drift rides remain a highlight for eventgoers. This year's edition of Motor Trend Presents Roadkill Nights powered by Dodge is set to take place this weekend, August 12th, from the heart of downtown Pontiac. With the new location comes an expanded footprint and even more exciting street-legal drag racing, including the revamped Grudge Race, where six teams of rookie mentor duos battle it out down famed Woodward Avenue. The event will also feature a classic and modern muscle car show, Dodge Thrill Rides, a closing musical performance from Ice Cube, and more. While much has changed through the years, the brotherhood of muscle remains stronger than ever. Get tickets to this year's Roadkill Nights at motortrend.com slash roadkillnights-2023. We'll see you there. Those are this week's top stories on Stellantis Spotlight. Reporting for Stellantis Digital Media, I'm Peter Spezia.